Hello everyone. Let's solve this problem very quickly. We have square root of x plus 1 plus square root of x equal to 2. Now the first step I will take is this. Square root of x plus 1 is equal to 2 minus square root of x. Okay, so the next thing I will do is to remove this square from here by squaring both sides. x plus 1 squared will be equal to 2 minus root x. Put this together and then you square. Now from here, square root and square will cancel each other. So that x plus 1 will be equal to 2 minus square root of x times 2 minus square root of x. Now, let's multiply. x plus 1 will be equal to 2 times 2 will give 4. 2 times minus root x will give minus 2 root x. Minus root x times 2 will give minus 2 root x. Then minus root x times root minus root x will give us positive x. And now, if you look at this, we have positive x and positive x on both sides. So they can cancel each other, right? So we have 1 to be equal to 4 minus... Here now, we are going to add the middle terms here as we have 4 root x x okay so this is what we have now the next thing to be done is okay let me take another step we have 4 minus 4 root x equal to 1 then from here 4 okay minus 4 root x will be equal to 1 minus 4 i'm trying to collect like terms here so that minus 4 root x will be equal to minus 3. The next thing I will do is to divide both sides by minus 4. So divide this by minus 4, and then divide this by minus 4. Okay, so from here, minus 4, minus 4 will cancel minus 4, and then we have root x which will be equal to 3 over 4. Then the next thing to be done is to remove this square from here, this square root from here, as I square both sides again. And I have 3 over 4 squared, right? So that's from here, this and this will cancel, and x will be equal to 3 over 4 squared, and this is going to give us um, 9 over 16. Okay, this is because if you have um, A over B squared, this is the same thing as A squared over B squared. Meaning that the square is for both the numerator and the denominator. Okay, so we are saying that X is equal to 9 over 16 but then let's go back and check to know if we are right or wrong the original equation is square root of x plus 1 okay plus square root of x equals 2 so we're going to put in the value of x and see if we will have um, 2 x is now 9 over 16 plus 1 then plus square root of um, x is now square root of 9 over 16 will this give us 2 let's process okay so from here we will be having square root of um okay this is the same thing as 9 over 16 plus 1 over 1 right then plus square root of 9 there 
is 3 and square root of 16 is 4. And then from here, we will find the LCM. Okay, so the LCM of, um, of 16 and 1 is 16. Okay, so 16 divided by 16 is 1 times 9 is 9. Plus 16 by 16 is 1 is 16 times 1 is 16. Then plus 3 over 4. Okay, so we'll continue with this. So that we will have um, 9 plus 16 will give 25. And this is over 16 plus 3 over 4. Remember, our target is to have um, is to get two at the end of um, our evaluation. Now, square root of twenty five is five, and square root of four, square root of sixteen is four. Is four. Then we are adding this three over four. Now let's process this. Remember, the LCM is now four. Then um, we have 5 plus 3. This is giving us 8 over 4. And 8 over 4 is giving us 2. Okay? And this is what we got on the right-hand side. So therefore, we are very correct to say that x is equal to 9 over 16. Thank you for watching.